This morning, an underage girl is hurt after being shot. Glad you're with us at 6 a.m. I'm Eric Connert. And I'm Dane Marie McNichol filling in for Netta Arampour. Now, the shooting happened in Oak Park overnight. Right now, police are still looking for that gunman. We have CBS 8's Chris Grow live outside San Diego Police Headquarters with what we know right now, Chris. Yeah, and what we've heard so far is that that girl is in the hospital being treated for her injuries, but this happened around 10 17 p.m. just late last night. It supposed to be just a normal summer night, but these kids hanging outside of the apartment, it turned into anything. But now uh, what we're being told is that gunshots were fired. This group of kids decided to run pretty normal reaction there. But what wasn't normal was the fact that during the time that they were running, that young girl felt pain, then found out she had been shot. So she was taken to the hospital where she was treated for non life threatening injuries. But then the, the concern became where and how uh, were these gunshots fired and who may have fired them. Now, as far as what police are going off of right now, they have no suspect description, no getaway car description, nothing to go on. They did collect some evidence. It appeared from the scene. We could see several of those evidence markers that were put on the floor, likely indicating that uh, those are, uh, excuse me, shell casings and that multiple shots were fired. Now, at this time, police needing the public's help right now. So they are asking anyone who may have been in the area that night, uh, last night and or early in the morning who may have seen anything that looked out of place or suspicious to call San Diego Police Department or Crime Stoppers where you can remain anonymous. Eric and Dana Marie.